local families mourning the loss of a brother and a sister killed in a tragic motorcycle accident. 7 Action News reporter Tara Edwards is on Detroit's West Side tonight with more on this story. He's the most beautiful person that I've ever met inside and out. Loved ones heartbroken. Realization sinks in about what happened early Sunday evening. 26 year old Jamel Brown and his sister, 15 year old Lucretia Johnson, were killed in a motorcycle crash here on Detroit's west side. Both of them just lit up a room whenever they were around. They brighten people's lives. According to state police, Jamel was driving his bike with his sister as a passenger, westbound on Seven Mile at a high rate of speed. A state trooper turned on his lights and siren to get them to stop, but Jamel failed to stop at the intersection and struck a car near Huntington. The siblings, who were extremely close, had just gotten ice cream. He FaceTimed me because I was at home back in Lansing just to show me that he was here. He saw my family and then he was taking her home, he was dropping her back off after he spent time with her. Lucretia was a student at Renaissance High School and wanted to be a psychiatrist. Jamel was in college and had a cleaning business called OCD. The family not only dealing with the devastation of their deaths, but they don't have the money for a burial for the siblings. Their mother, who recently battled cancer, is struggling to find the funds. Here you see her with Jamel, who shaved his head while she was going through chemo. Loved ones have set up a GoFundMe page to help, but they still need more money. We want to lay them right. to rest Properly. and peace. Even though our minds and oh, this, it's going to be so hard. <laughs> But I want to do this for them because that's what both of them deserve. And the case is being investigated by the state police. If you are interested in helping out the family, we have more information on our website at WXYZ.com. On Detroit's west side, Tara Edwards, 7 Action News.